My name is Deepshika Ramanan. Uh, I'm a third year fellow and uh, I'm a postdoc at Harvard Medical School. I think I've always wanted to be a scientist all my life. Um, I can remember when I was like five or six years old, me and my siblings would always cut up earthworms in our backyard, um, try to play with insects, frogs, all sorts of little creatures that we could get our hands on. And then when I was in high school, my grandmother developed diabetes and I saw her suffer with a lot of side effects, a lot of symptoms of diabetes and its medication that they had at that time. She eventually lost her life uh, because of some of the complications and that really got me interested in trying to understand what causes these diseases, why do we get them, and what can we do so people don't suffer from them. When I got to graduate school, I started working on the intestine, which was really fascinating to me because it was around the time where the microbiome research was up and coming. And I realized that there were um, certain types of cancers that were associated with imbalances in these populations of bacteria. So when I finished my PhD, I wanted to switch my focus to understanding how differences in these proportions or um, types of commensal bacteria that live on our skin and in our gut can affect um, cancer and cancer biology. It's fascinating that something as little as bacteria could modulate whether or not we can develop cancer. That's really fascinating to me. Our cells are a lot more evolved than them, but somehow we're not able to fight them the way you know, they're able to kind of evade us in a way. Some of the research suggests that the bacteria that we get from our mothers early on in life, like when we're infants, can influence what diseases we get when we're older or our health status when we're older. So what I wanted to see is what is it that the mothers pass on to the babies and how does that affect our susceptibility to these diseases or cancer later on in life. Funding in science is one of the biggest things we need because scientists are really working hard, coming up with great ideas, coming up with extremely innovative ideas to try and cure and understand the mechanism behind so many diseases right now. Knowing that I'm being funded by the donors of Damon Runyon makes me more empowered to do the work that I do and it makes it pushes me to sort of do the best that I can do uh, and come up with the best ideas that I can. The fact that we feel like we're in the brightest cohort of scientists motivates us to do even better and hopefully find cures for cancer and other diseases.